Stir fry. Stir fry is great this time of year, any time of year when you want to get dinner on the table fast. A couple ways you can do it to save some time, but I'm going to show you my off the cuff stir fry recipe. Hi, I'm Nika Waters and welcome to Tasty Thursday. Today we're talking stir fry. You can do it chicken or vegetable or anything you want. You never have to use meat. If you don't want to use chicken, don't. The trick with stir fry, at least in my opinion, is not to put too many vegetables in there. You want them to all be kind of crisp and the perfect texture, and so if you overload them it's kind of hard to keep track of cooking time. So I like to have a combination of texture and color in my stir fries. So I am using four as kind of a max. I've got carrots, broccoli, red pepper for a burst of bright. What else do I have? Mushrooms. Mushrooms. I love mushrooms. And I've cut them big enough so my kids can pick them out. And then I have the onions and the garlic and the ginger that I sort of don't count. So. So there you have it, a really, really super easy stir fry that you can serve on top of rice or on top of quinoa or on top of noodles or on top of rice noodles or on top of tortillas or just eat straight like it is. Happy, happy, tasty Thursday. If you like what you've seen, press like. Tag a friend you think should see it. Don't forget to subscribe. Who knows what's coming up next week. I'll see you back here next Thursday. So this is a piece that's still kind of frozen. You'll see how much easier it is to cut than a piece that is not frozen. Um, and so if you want to make it a little easier on yourself, certainly throw your chicken breasts in the freezer for a little bit.